There is a massive backlog of unemployment insurance claims filed in Arizona, but tonight there is some help on the way. The state just hired an independent contractor to process all of that paperwork. Our political editor, Dennis Welch, live for us in Phoenix. Uh, Dennis, this is helpful, but uh, people might still have to wait a couple more weeks to see any of that cash. Yeah, they're going to be... Yeah, they are going to be waiting a little bit longer. It's been a long time for them already, but over the past month, we have seen a historic surge in unemployment claims here in the state. Now, at the same time, tens of thousands of these workers' claims have been denied simply because they wouldn't have qualified under normal circumstances. We are talking about part-time workers. We're talking about self-employed workers who have basically just seen their jobs, their work, just vanish over the past few weeks and months. Now, in fact, the state has seen a surge of nearly 420,000 unemployment claims. At the same time, 150,000 or 35% of those claims have been denied to those who are self-employed and working part-time. Now, those workers, unemployment eligibility will now be reassessed because Dom, Tom Betlack, the director of the Department of Economic Security, hired Geographic Solutions Incorporated to speed up the process of getting money into the hands of those who need it the most. Now, to do that, the state is paying the firm $2 million this year to upgrade its 40-year-old computer system. That week of May 12th is when we're targeting to start pushing checks out. So that's not to say everybody that's qualified for pool will receive their checks that week. So again, it looks like it's going to be at least another three, four weeks, possibly longer for some people as they reassess and work on this backlog of people who have been denied. And again, it's worth noting at this point, if you are someone who's been denied, but you think you are eligible for this money, you have to keep updating your claim weekly with the Department of Economic Security here in Arizona. And that will send it back into you.